I heard a woman screaming. Did you happen to see anyone near the house? Anyone who looked suspicious? Yeah. Early this morning, there was this guy near the gangway. He was just walking around. He seemed out of place. I'm not saying he killed her. I'm just saying I noticed him. Okay. Can you describe the guy? He was black. I mean, African-American. Um, average height. Thin and young, early 20s. See what he was wearing? He had a white hat on his head. That's all I remember. But again, I'm not saying this man is involved. And it has nothing to do with the fact he's African-American. Right, he just looked suspicious. Like he was casing the house that he was about to rob, right? Yeah, he looked suspicious. Very suspicious. And he was holding something in his right hand, too, under his jacket. Crowbar? Maybe I couldn't tell. Chase. I'm not the only person in the city of Chicago with a blue Honda. You're the only one with a Franklin Plastics decal on it. What's going on, Dad? Go back inside. I just wanted to know if you're okay. Get back inside now. What happened to your eye? Don't talk to my daughter. Let her answer the question. She plays soccer, okay? She caught an elbow yesterday after school. Is that what happened? Did that happen at soccer practice? Yes, yesterday after school. Kia, go to your room now. You got some nerve accusing me. I didn't accuse you of anything. I asked a question. Get off my property or I'll file a complaint. I want the name of that soccer coach. I want your badge number. 55055. Five, oh, five, five. Detective Upton. Why don't I take it from here? No, we're okay. all right. No, no, no. I'm going to take this. I got it, Detective Upton. She's got no right asking me questions like that. Sir, I know you're None whatsoever. I know you're upset. All I care about is the blue Honda, most likely your car I saw fleeing the scene of a murder this morning. Murder? Yes, murder. That's why we're here, sir. That's why we need to know where you were this morning. I was here at home. Who else has access to the car? A kid from the neighborhood, Devin Williams. I'm trying to help him out. He runs errands for us. I gave him the car last night. He's a good kid. He wouldn't do anything like this. Well, did he return the car? No, he hasn't. Where does he live? With his grandma. Corner of 10th and Bradley. Tan house. All right, thank you. I apologize. What's going on with you? What the hell was that? Kid had a black eye. Yeah, it sounds like she got it at soccer practice. You kept pushing. We're chasing a murder. I don't here. care what we're chasing. She's a kid. She needs to be protected. That is not the point. I asked a simple question. It's not a big deal. Haley, look. You outranked me and everything, but if you're going to accuse a father of smacking around his kid, he. You gotta have some evidence first. I did. It's called a black eye. Don't ever undermine me or dismiss me from an interview like that again. Hold up. Bingo, blue Honda inside. Hey, stop right there! Stop, man! Stop! Whoa, whoa, whoa. Get him! Stay down! Hey, hey, hey! You're done, bro! You're done! You're done! You're done! You're done. You're done. Stay down, pal! Stay down! You're under arrest for murder! No, 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 no! No, you got the wrong guy! I got, I got nothing to do with that murder on the north side, I swear! You got the wrong guy! Murder on the north side? What you talking about, pal? Huh? That lady got killed! Huh? I, 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 didn't, I didn't do that, I swear! Okay, we believe you, Devin. We really do. Come on. This guy bluffing? Is he really that clueless? Yo, just talk to the lab. Yeah, still no fingerprints or DNA hits. We got the witness, though, Sergeant. Neighbor said you got a good look at the offender. Yeah, that's right. We'll get her down here right away. I'm pretty sure it's number three. Good. Thank you. Why don't we step outside? Kid is a trip. Yep. Can't figure out where he's coming from. You know, well, whatever he's doing, it's working. It's been seven hours. He hasn't given up a damn thing. Yeah, he hasn't lawyered up yet, though, which is good, but it's odd. I mean, I don't know why he's still talking to us. He doesn't know any better. Lab says there's still no forensics tying Devin to the crowbar, the body, the crime scene, nothing. Sarge, let me take a run at him. I'm going over his file. I think I have an angle to play. Give it a shot. Oh, kid wants a pop. Ah, uh, 